So yes, it's still bearing, no ripening taking place yet. I am anxiously waiting for the peppers to get ripe. That's one of my gardening journey moments when my peppers start to um, ripen. They're still doing very well. No ripe peppers yet. And we have Miss Okra. The okra is doing really, really well this year. I'm usually not lucky with okras, but I think this might just be the perfect position for okras. I've never planted them on this part of the garden before and this year thanks to Mwani I decided to plant some okras over here and I'll say they're doing really really well growing big I think I think some of it is really beginning to bear as you can see already so these are my okras again I have a couple of them right down the middle row over here and they're doing well they're doing well Vegetable number three that sparks a lot of joy. My country, Jama Jama, also known as Jamso Limbo, also known as Garden Cocoa Berry. I'll try to put the scientific name on the screen. So look at what one week, what a difference one week makes. I might harvest some this week, I think, either tomorrow or later today. I will let my harvester in chief come and deal with this one because every time I harvest, I still have the aphids. The aphids trying to attack. In Limbo, they call this kukur or something. But they are ants just causing the aphids to crawl and I don't have to see them. I must bring pepper mixed with soap and mixed with water to take care of the aphids attack but generally Jamsa is doing okay and then the bitter leaves I've been harvesting these and there's still plenty more to harvest I'll harvest some today and process and then donate some of the stems to a friend to propagate in their garden so the bitter leaves is doing very well. Here's some that I propagated earlier this year. As you can see, it's picking up. So you can propagate bitter leaves from the stem. I don't think I've ever shared this mint plant before, but I have mint in a container over here. I've had this plant for a very, very long time. It never dies. It's one of those things that when you have once, you have it forever. It never dies. And I hardly ever use it. Not sure why, but it's here. This is the west end for the left side of my garden. This is where I nursed the country Jaman Jama before transplanting. Um, it looks better than last week, but it still needs a lot of care. So I'm just going to be patient with this. And here's the pumpkin. It's limbo. They call it Chebo. I think it has picked up nicely. It's not quite at the point of harvesting yet, I think. But I'll let my harvester in chief let me know if we can maybe cut something I don't know so that it spreads out I'm not quite sure but that's the pumpkin so we call it and here's my little herb garden the basils are picking up I think they need some tender loving TLC 
Now the girls the way them caution yeah. Everywhere she pass now so the boys them all like yeah. you marry me baby Amanda I will you marry me baby Amanda I will you marry me baby Amanda I will you marry me baby Amanda I think it's looking so much better I've removed a lot of the weed it's right here and I'm trimming not trimming it's cleaning up this container of aloe vera that I never do anything with it's a bunch of aloe vera plants now has thorns all over the whole place it's overcrowded so let's remove some of the aloe vera let's see what we can do with it Remove this one. Baby aloe veras all over the place. this area move the aloe plant to that corner I have a bunch of shoots I'm not sure what I'll do with them but I don't feel like throwing them ah, okay I just had an idea I'm gonna clean up this area and cultivate these aloe plants that I just offrooted from the container there directly into the soil that's what I'll do aloe vera oh, I am absolutely loving what I have just done it took me about one hour believe it or not to clean up that space I think I'm gonna put a nice bench over here now I have a couple of aloe vera plants one two three four five six plus two here that I trimmed finally today and now I'm stuck with a bunch of leaves that I have to figure out what to do with these because I'm not throwing these away so please guys if you have any ideas drop them in the comments ideas that don't involve drinking any of this maybe skincare hair care I would like to know how you use your aloe vera Mama me coming Amanda by a bag of it. Yellow, more. No, I tap a baker. 
Your bow, my fake guy. Gary, Gary, Jerry, Jerry, I'm a moon. 